welcome to another one. This is a new episode on Big Brother Mzanzi. Now, let's start with Liema. Liema is almost every time in the news, but this time, it looks like somebody in Liema's team needs to be sacked. Because how did this kind of mistake happen? Now, I'm saying mistake because that's what they're trying to make us believe that it is. But we know better. I say somebody in Liema's team paid somebody in the production team for the show, and they made this a thing on the menu of Big Brother Mzanzi. Like, fans are so not having it right now. I'm going to just say that this is not a mistake. This was intentional, very intentional, because they wanted to cause controversy, they wanted to make her trend, and they actually wanted to boost her winnings or boost her chances of winning the show. Because, honestly, somebody in her team needs to answer for this, and Big Brother also needs to do something about the person that did this on his team, on the show's team, because it's cheating, clearly. This is cheating. How do you say starring Liema? Really? Not only Liema did the show, it's clearly some kind kind of cheating this is this should be against the rules and if you say oh the rules are not fair whatever but this is just wrong sha that's all i know this is wrong now let's go on to z and almost everybody at this point honestly because i'm even confused now z confessed that she was feeling a certain way about the fact that papi's girlfriend was expecting him out of the house and back in her arms what do i mean Basically, when the families came to visit, Papi's cousin came to visit and she's like, oh, how's your girlfriend is outside the house. She's waiting for you. And, she, you know, she wants to continue the relationship. And then Z told Papi that, oh, I was sad to hear that. She admitted that she didn't know that she was going to feel like that. But I mean, what do you expect with someone who told you he had a girlfriend outside the house? And then he cheats on that girlfriend with you. And then you go and you're not going to catch feelings. Who does that? Like, why we going to catch feelings? It's a show for the love of God. Now, let's be honest. Papi may like Z, but he's also playing a game. Okay. He's also clearly playing a game. And to now make matters worse, Z might also be trying to play games. Now that we know that Papi's girlfriend is back in the picture somehow, maybe she's trying to give him space by flirting with other people, aka Liema and Yolanda. Yes, I know I mentioned two, two ladies' names. It was intentional because Z is not clinching on any man again now outside Papi. Maybe because all the men are taken. So <laughs> she's like, okay, let's go to the ladies. And Lema that said, you know, she likes girls before. And Yolanda, who we don't even know what she is. Well, she has kissed Lema and she has kissed Yolanda two times. And in that same bed... Where she, okay, she kissed Liema separately in the pool, kissed Yolanda in the bed. Guess who was there both times? Young Papi, smiling and just watching the whole thing. As a matter of fact, with the one with Yolanda, he was struggling with Yolanda for a kiss from Z. Honestly, I feel like, you know, this is some kind of a twisted game that they're playing. And I'm wondering, like, what exactly is really happening. But definitely, they're both playing each other at this point. But let's see who's the better player and let's see how far they will take this before the show ends. Now, finally, this particular subject is a bit dicey because even in real life, it's hard to discuss this. But Mpumi was upset about the fact that no single girl in the house told her that she had body odor and she had to hear it from Ghost. How did she hear it? Well, Yolanda mentioned it, told Ghost about it, and Ghost started a rumor in the house that... Umpumi doesn't have a bath like she doesn't bathe she doesn't you know shower things like that and of course that rumor spread and well to a ghost's credit somehow he actually went up to Umpumi and told her specifically that oh you know this is happening I think you have this body thingy going on and they're calling it like a glandular smelling I don't know, maybe it's a condition or something. But yeah, he told her basically. And she's like, how am I hearing it from him? And no girl in this house told me. Now, personally, I think it can be painful, particularly thinking that you have friends that can tell you stuff and be truthful with you. But let's be honest, to discuss body odor is not easy like that. It's not easy. It's not easy to tell somebody that, oh, I think you kind of smell from time to time, or maybe you should shower more. It is not easy. Let's not lie. Let's not lie. So being mad about it is justified, but it's also kind of unfair because it's a sensitive topic, just like Yolanda said. So I want to just ask this, you know, put this out there, ask you, is it easy like to talk to someone and tell them, I think you have body odor? Is it, is it easy? 
And what would you do if you were the one? <laughs> well, let's know in the comments. That's it on Big Brother Mzansi. There's definitely more coming up because the house is heating up with every day that passes. But this will be it today. I'm calling today on this one. Remember to like, subscribe and share it to everyone that you know. Catch you on the next one.